Coverage you can count on with meteorologist Grace Anello and the Way 31 Storm Tracker Early Warning Radar Network. All righty. Well, the Way 31 Storm Tracker Early Warning Radar Network is picking up on some showers in the area. These are not quite widespread. They're really isolated in nature, meaning that many of us are still completely dry. But those that are seeing rain are seeing heavy downpours. I am expecting more of these to come into the region as we head into dinner time and even a little bit later this evening. But more on that in a minute. Well, right now, all across the northern part of the state, what we're seeing is blue sky and plenty of those clouds. Now, of course, that blue sky could get a little bit darker with some rain chances, and those clouds are telling us that there's plenty of moisture in the air. Our temperatures for most of us hanging out in the mid and low 90s, 95 in Muscle Shoals, 91 in Decatur. Now, as we head through the rest of the evening this evening, it is not a washout by any stretch, and honestly, I wouldn't even recommend canceling your plans. Keep those plans going, but just know you might need to run inside for a few minutes as a passing shower does pass through your area. By the time we get to 7 p.m. tonight, those temperatures will be in the mid 80s. And just after that, we're looking at the low 80s. Alrighty, well, let's walk through what you can expect for the rest of your Saturday evening. This puts us about 45 minutes from now at 6 o'clock. We are continuing to see those isolated showers, but really you'll see many of us are still dry. Now, by the time we get to 930, they start to cluster a little more for us to our west central counties. Now, the good news is by the time we get just past 930, these are out of the way. And we do have that cloud cover in the central part of the state, but the rest of us are dry. So many of us will remain completely dry this evening. Even those of us that do see rain, just take a quick dip inside and then come back on out. So your bonfire forecast for this evening, your rain chance is low, your humidity is moderate, and oh yes, it is s'mores weather. And let me tell you, if you're making s'mores, I would like to be invited over personally. Your overnight low temperature is at 70 degrees. Again, it will be partly cloudy and mild with that slight chance for rain heading into dinner time. Well, your Sunday forecast is looking pretty similar to how we look today. So if you're like me and you enjoyed today's weather, then you're in for a treat tomorrow. We're looking at 92 degrees tomorrow. Again, that slight chance for rain, but many of us will continue to remain dry. So the question is, do you need to water the plants and do you need to water the garden? Well, on Sunday, I'm going to tell you yes, but then the rest of the week, don't worry about it. The atmosphere is going to water those plants for you. And here's what we're looking at by way of a seven day. Make sure you enjoy the sunshine tomorrow because that will be your last day to really soak it up for the last little bit this week. Our heaviest chances for rain are Monday and Tuesday. Those temperatures sit right at and right below 90. That's the reason you don't need to water your garden is because of all that rain. And then the trash pandas are back starting midweek, but so are those rain chances. Even more to come next Saturday. Those temperatures for us gradually getting lower and lower.